The North Carolina Zoo has been involved in wildlife conservation programs in Africa for many years. The latest of those is an effort to save one of the most endangered apes found on equatorial Africa, the Cross River Gorilla. Seen here in Cameroon's Limbe Wildlife Center, the secretive Cross River Gorilla is rarely seen in the wild. The North Carolina Zoo is working with the Wildlife Conservation Society to collect important data for the preservation of these endangered animals. Sometimes gorilla tracks are quite obvious. So they have been feeding on these barks. Gorillas will push down large trees and break large branches. You can see here, this is another feeding sign. But other times, the track might be something as simple as a turned leaf or a scratch in the dirt. What you see in front of me is fresh feeding signs. You eventually land up at either the gorilla's nest site or seeing the gorillas themselves. Where we're sitting right now is where the gorillas slept last night. The silverback, the adult male of the group, will give an alarm call to alert the other gorillas that there are, there's something nearby. For Cross River Gorillas, that was a really good sighting in all the years that I've been working on these animals. That's the closest that I've seen them, and that's the first time that I've ever been actually charged by a silverback. Collecting basic information on an animal seldom even seen by humans can be both difficult and dangerous, but it's essential if the Cross River Gorilla is to survive. If you'd like to learn more about the Cross River Gorilla or read Dr. Burgle's field reports, please check out our educational website at fieldtripearth.org. I'm Rod Hackney reporting for the Zoo Files, connecting your life to wildlife.